What's up planner babes? It's your girl Cam and I'm back with another video. Today I'm coming at you with something a little bit different. As you can tell from the title of this video, I am going to share a Dollar Tree haul with you. I love the Dollar Tree almost as much as I love planning. <laughs> almost as much. And so in this haul I'm going to show you some planner items and I'm also going to show you some home decor items because I also enjoy um, home decor as well. So if this is your first time visiting my channel, welcome, welcome. I hope that you will find some inspiration here and that you will consider hitting that subscribe button along with the notification bell so you won't miss any videos I have coming up for you in the next few weeks. If you're already a part of the Peace of the Plans fam, welcome back. So if you want to see what I have gathered from the Dollar Tree in my most recent visits, just stick around. Alright, so let's start with the planner items first. So I found these really cute um, planner stickers at the Dollar Tree and there are one, two, three, four Dollar Trees <laughs> near where I live. And there is one in particular that has, well actually two, that have all the things that you would ever look for in Dollar Tree. I mean every single thing you would need for planning, for a DIY. For home decor, they have everything. I live smack in the middle of two of them. So I found this really cute planner sticker set from one of those very reliable Dollar Trees. And it has the gold foil look to it. It's not real gold foil, but it kind of looks like gold foil. And it has stickers that say things like brilliant, nope, shine bright, today's the day, Frye, um, your magic, shine bright. It has the little emojis down at the bottom and stickers that say, um, you got this, cray. <laughs> so all kinds of really cute stickers to add to your planner. I would love to do a spread with these in my pen and gear planner. The colors are really bright and vibrant. And then on the back side, you have some other cute stickers, you've got some um, hot air balloons, some hearts, some pineapples, some arrows, some little watermelon slices. Ooh, you got the coffee cups there, they're very cute. You've got some gems, and you've got some speech bubbles down at the bottom, and also some appointment labels. So this was a really cute set, and they had lots of different versions of this sticker set in my Dollar Tree. So this was the first planner related item. The second one is this um, different version of the planner stickers. It has things like to-do flags and grocery shopping carts and gotta do this, a lot of gotta do this labels. You got deadline, important, lunch, dollar signs or budgeting, make it happen, and more today flags. So you got to do at the top and then today's at the bottom right there. Then on the back, you got the peace sign. You know I love anything that has the peace sign on it. You got that, you got speech bubbles, pencils, uh, you got some cacti and some lips and some cherries, some more speech bubbles, some donuts, paper airplanes and globes. So this is really cute. I personally like this, but if you have a daughter that wants to get into planning and you don't want to spend a whole lot on planner supplies for her, this would be a great, great way to get your daughter started in planning. And as I'm thinking about that, I have a friend who wants her daughter, actually her daughter wants to get into planning. And she's asked me about some places to get stickers. So I'm going to suggest, I may even grab a couple more of these for her daughter. Because this is a great way to get um, teenagers um, into being more organized. And getting all their assignments together. Getting their homework organized. Cleaning up their room. So this is a really cute, cute sticker set. 
And again, it's cute if you have a daughter that really wants to get into planning. So that's the second planner related item. Next, I found this adorable mermaid pen. Y'all, is this not cute? I mean, look at that little mermaid tail. It is too adorable. <laughs> and they had several different versions of this, but I wanted the one that had the, I don't know if you can catch it on camera. It looks kind of purple on camera, but it's really more like a hot pink. And I really wanted this one with the little pink tail. So it's so cute. Now I have not written with it yet. So let's open it up and let's see how it writes. Oh, look, this did not come from Dollar Tree. We're just doing a little pen test. So let's see. Piece of the plans. Okay, I mean it writes okay. It writes okay. It's not a gel pen. It's not a gel pen, but it, it, it writes decent, but really it's just for the cuteness of it. It's super cute. If this was a gel pen, I would love it a lot more, but it's super, super cute. So that is from the Dollar Tree, a cute little mermaid pen. I'm going to put it in my cup. <laughs> the next items are some three-dimensional stickers. Some of them are three-dimensional. Most of them are three-dimensional, but I thought this would be really cute for back to school. So you've got... Um, they're called pop-up stickers. That's what it says at the top, pop-up stickers. And there are 12 stickers on here, but they say things like smile, there's a feather, camera, the best, there's a guitar, the word girl, your little converse, pink converse, a little Vespa, another feather, this is me, headphones, and my life. So again, this is cute if you have a daughter who wants to get into planning. I personally love it and I would definitely use this in my planner. It might be a little bit too kitty for some people, but I really think it's just adorable and I think it would be really cute in a planner setup. Um, even in your, um, in your dashboard pockets, it would be cute to decorate your dashboards with these. So again, these came from the Dollar Tree, super cute. And I have more along that same line. This one is another pop-up set. And I'm going to call this one Selfie because that's what it says at the top. You've got the I love you sign and sign language. You've got um, all the little emojis. Rock, brave, rad. Another peace sign. I love it. I am. Wi-Fi. Dream catcher. So super cute for your planner. I would definitely use this in my pen and gear planner. I may... I may actually use this in a couple weeks because this is really, really cute before the fall stickers come into play. It's very cute. And another one, I know summer is almost over, but the thing about Dollar Tree is if you don't grab stuff when you see it, typically when you come back, it's going to be gone. So even if I have to save these until next summer, I'm okay with that because I think these are super cute for um, either a scrapbook spread or for your planner. I could actually put this in my um, summer prayer journal just to kind of finish it up. This would be really cute. Then you've got things like, um, it says refreshing, happy summer, I love the summer, relax, sunshine, life's better on the beach, and then look at these beautiful alphas. So cute. All of this for $1. I'm here for it. And finally, I went back to the Dollar Tree um, just the other day, right before we went to um, see a movie, and I found these cute, I have seen these on planner stickers, these mermaids. It's the long sheet, it's the long sheet of stickers, I, these are supposed to be wall decals. but. This is so cute. I don't think I would hang this on my wall, but I mean, this could go in a classic size happy planner. Or you could even make a planner cover out of this. I just had an idea. This would make a perfect summer planner cover, y'all. OMG. Too cute. So again, I got this. I know summer is coming to a close. But I got this because I love it and if I wait until next summer they may or may not have these same stickers so I don't like to hoard stickers but I do believe in grabbing what you see at Dollar Tree right then because 
it will be gone the next time you come back okay so this is going to be a planner cover y'all this is too cute i'm going to turn this into a planner cover omg i love it okay so let's move on to the home decor items so i found these cute fall coffee mugs so cute and i am a ray dunn mug collector so I typically have just the plain Ray Dunn mugs, but I thought these were too cute for the fall. So I'm going to um, definitely use these in my fall coffee bar. Look at that design all the way around. They only had three of these, so I grabbed the three that I saw. But then I also saw this really cute girl boss mug, and I've never seen this before at Dollar Tree, and it's got the fall um, rusty orange on it. So I thought I could use this too in my coffee bar for the fall. So super cute. Then, then I found this cute little Hello Fall table decor. You could easily use this in your kitchen as part of your dining room tablescape. You could even use this in the bathroom. I mean, if you set up your entire house for the season, this would be super cute sitting up in the corner on the counter in your bathroom. Super, super cute with some potpourri or something around it a little bowl of potpourri in front of it or a bowl of soap or whatever in front of it, this would be super cute. It's very tiny. It's about the size of my, well, not tiny because my hands are not tiny, but it's um, it's not really big is what I'm trying to say. It's about the size of my hand and it was just a dollar, but it was very, very cute. I'm going to add this. I have lots of fall decor already, but I'm going to add this to my decor, possibly on my dining room uh, table. So this was really cute too. Next thing I found was this cute little chalkboard, little pumpkin chalkboard that is also going to be a part of my coffee bar. So you can just, I could write the word coffee on here or a good morning on here and add it to the section of my kitchen where my coffee bar is going to be set up. So I thought this was really cute and it has that little farmhouse chic kind of effect to it. And last but not least, um, I feel kind of bad about doing this because <laughs> I know I'm super, super early, but um, I found some stuff for Christmas, y'all. I know, I know, I know it's early, I, I know, but like I said, if you don't grab things as soon as you see them in the Dollar Tree, they will be gone. Okay, so here we go. Let's just do it. <laughs> So I love buffalo plaid. It is like my favorite thing for decorating for Christmas. And I have done red buffalo plaid for the last maybe four Christmases. And what I typically do is I do the buffalo plaid with a little bit of bling added to it. So it's kind of like a farmhouse kind of chic. And this year, well actually last year, I knew that for this Christmas coming up, I wanted to change from red buffalo plaid to black and white buffalo plaid y'all and when I saw that they had the black and white buffalo plaid at Dollar Tree I about lost my mind I mean I really did because my living room is right next to my dining room and kitchen like I live in a small apartment so it's all like right there together and so whatever I do for the Christmas tree in the living room area has to match my dining room and has to match uh, my kitchen. So when I saw these oven mitts, I almost lost it, y'all. One dollar? <sighs> okay, so I got two oven mitts in the black and white buffalo plaid. And look at these cute kitchen towels that say blessed. Black and white check, black and white buffalo plaid. And this came in Oh, these were just singles. Okay, and you know, just to be honest, we all know that the Dollar Tree hand towels, the kitchen towels are not super absorbent. So this is really not for cleaning purposes. This is really just for cuteness in your kitchen. You gotta have some other towels in the, in the drawer for cleaning up spills <laughs> and stuff like that. But this is really cute for um, decorating. And I love the buffalo plaid of it. And I may go back and get two more because I know that somebody's going to grab this and grab a pizza or grab a lasagna out of the oven and mess it up. But for a dollar, I can afford to go get a couple more, right? Right. Super, super cute. Okay, and the last thing 
that I found in the buffalo plaid pattern were these little pot holders. So if they come in sets of two, but I did get two of these because you know some you can actually actually use functionally and some you can hang up as decoration or I can even add some little um, decor on here, add a S for my uh, family last name, I could add a snowflake on here, or even a reindeer, any number of things you can do with this stuff to kind of zhuzh it up a little bit. Okay, so that is it for my Dollar Tree haul. I hope that you enjoyed this planner babes because I really, really love the Dollar Tree for so many reasons. Like, why go to a store and pay three, four, or five dollars when you can get the same thing or something very close to it for one dollar? Like, why not? <laughs> so I love the Dollar Tree for planner stuff, for home decor. For cleaning supplies, the Dollar Tree is definitely my friend. So, I hope you enjoyed this video, Planner Babes. If you did, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. If you're not already a part of the Peace of the Plans fam, I hope you'll take a moment and hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell so you won't miss any videos I have coming up for you in the next few weeks. If you're already a part of the fam, thank you so much for coming back. I hope you have a great week. I hope your week is full of love, joy, and most of all, Peace. I'll see you next time.